25 mile per hour wind gusts. Some good news out of Burnett County, where a fire that threatened homes is now fully contained. Fire crews stayed on scene all night north of Burnett to get a handle on the flames. KXAN's Alicia Inns looks at how the weather made the effort tougher for firefighters. The smoke is starting to settle after the fire burned all night long. Now, what's left is ashes and debris from the trees that have been burning all night long along FM 963. That's about six miles east of State Highway 281. And 10 area fire departments have been working on this. Along with the Texas Forest Service, big dozers have been cutting fire lines, helping them contain it. The U.S. Fish and Wildlife, they've been monitoring environmental impact of this 45 acre fire. And at least six homes were threatened overnight. And so fire officials evacuated people in those homes. Thankfully, they were able to let them back in when crews deemed it was safe enough. Now, high winds in this area yesterday really played a factor into how the crews battled the blaze. Didn't really do them any favors out here as well. And, you know, they also monitor the weather, really rely on Mother Nature to help them, but it can also hurt the fight of the fire. And so at this point, everything's grown up, and now it's starting to dry out. So now we have a heavy fuel load, lots of dry uh, grass, brush, trees, and things like that. They're making the conditions very prime for horrible grass fires. Officials say another issue is the terrain out here. You see all these cedar trees. It makes it actually pretty hard for crews to get in the crevices and try and fight the fire. But again, 100% contained out here in Burnett County. Reporting in Burnett County, Alicia Inns, KXAN News.